is leading the race to become the Instagram of video? It's a big question, and we got Spencer Ante helping us uh, handicap the pack, which is pr getting pretty crowded now. It's a crowded um, field, getting um, more crowded by the day. Now, you wrote a story with um, Jessica Vassalero, and yes. you highlight five companies. Let's uh, let's deal with the, the biggest <coughs> first, Social Cam. Who are they, and, um, and, and what are they doing to become the Instagram of video? Right, so... After Facebook bought Instagram for a billion dollars, it set off this whole stampede. Which I still think is insane for a company with no revenue. But anyway, there Zuckerberg you go. said he would do it again. So I, yeah, I did hear that Touché. too, which was which was is even more insane. But yeah. anyway, carry on. So basically, Social Cam uh, is 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 the largest of the mobile video startups. It has 36 million users. It's founded in September of 2011. The growth is pretty extraordinary. It's um, based in um, uh, Silicon Valley. And it, There's a shocker. Yeah. Uh, not all these companies are based in Silicon Valley, actually. Some of them are, some of them aren't. Okay. But basically, the, the, sort of the, the one advantage that social cam has is that it actually doesn't place a limit on the on the time of the video that you can upload. So you could and put share. out a four hour video and, and we could, you could do I don't that. know if anyone's ever tried a four hour video, but you could some theoretically of the, some like Viddy, the number two service, which yeah. has twenty six million users, they actually limit clips to fifteen seconds. Um, so that's pretty but I mean that's pretty amazing. So so it's only ten million less and you can only have a fifteen second clip. Right? I think that's one of the reasons that social cam is sort of extending its lead on Viddy. These these two apps are basically basically vying for the top spot in the free section of the Apple App Store all yeah. last week. But just in the last few days, Social Cam has like sort of extended a lead. I think it's because of that time limit. Okay, now Mobley, um, who are they and, and what, why are they Mobley's lagging actually, ma massively, three million? Well, what? they're based in New York. On well, that's they, not why they're lagging, because clearly New York's awesome. Yeah, I don't know. I don't think that's why they're lagging either. I'm not exactly sure why they're lagging so much, but three million is not a number to sneeze at. That's a pretty decent sized number of users. Uh, they're actually their, their pace of their growth is picking up. They don't have a time limit on their on their um, clips either. Mm -hmm. So that actually means that they might be um, picking up or, or closing mm -hmm. the gap between them and Viddy. Then we have Color Labs, which is the notorious startup in Silicon Valley that raised $41 million uh, and then completely flopped its launch. They've kind of pivoted to from sort of photo sharing to video sharing, which shows you the fervor in this field. And it's moving, and there's another one named Clip, which we don't know anything about. Clip, um, it was actually backed by, the, by uh, Benchmark Capital, which is the same company that was the lead investor in Instagram. So they are relatively new, and they haven't announced how many users they have, so it's hard to say where they are in the race. But they, they, you know, they have a lot of money. They have $8 million, and they, are, and they have a pretty good uh, app that they put out there.